Headbangers Ball continues with me now as promised from Exodus. We have Rick and Gary. Guys, welcome. Cheers. Thanks a lot. Jet lagging all the way on, on, uh, yeah. onto our bus. Red Eye Special. Nice of you to fly in though. This is a nice uh, bus actually, man. It's a musical yeah, bus in fact. It's really cool. Um, April is drawing very near. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The Headbangers Ball Tour. You guys are going to be along on, on the road with uh, Halloween and Exodus. And Anthrax. Excuse me, and Anthrax. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I think I was on that same flight that you were on. All with, the same anthrax, thing. Yeah. So, you excited about it? Oh, oh yeah, man. we're fired up. It's going to be incredible. You guys have played with Anthrax before, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, we did uh, last US tour, they did with them like 14 shows. Uh, it's going to be great, like this one, though. This one's going to be a lot better. What, what do you expect, uh, as in a lot better? Mayhem. <laughs> Bigger, more shows, basically. You know, uh -huh. like I said, we only did 14 shows at last tour, we're doing 30 now. So you guys are promoting it to death, so that's just be pretty good. In fact, good. you know I'm going to be at Long Beach, and, and you know about the opening, right? Yeah, you just <laughs> told us. <laughs> it's going to be incredible. It's but it's, it's, it's the big secret. <laughs> um, Don't tell. So about the fabulous disaster, we're going to show the... This is the first video release off it, as far as I know? Yeah, this yeah, is the first video first we've video ever done. Ever. Uh, now, for the video shoot, I was told that you guys invited a whole bunch of other bands to come down and, and hang out. Yeah. Well, just, you know, all our friends. Just anybody who wanted to, basically, but, uh, like... Billy Milano from M.O.D. flew out, and Anthrax we were in town for mm -hmm. the Ozzy tour. And oh. then, like, all the local bands showed up. Forbidden, Testament, Laws, everybody was there. And you understand I'm upset about not receiving the invitation. I'm sorry, Adam, man. Uh, <laughs> I don't even want to Accept our humble apologies. No, no, but Toxic Waltz, I mean, this is uh, you guys on stage. Do you see any of your buddies that are... Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Time? Yeah, I see like people a lot live, of them. like live right on the next street to me dancing across the stage. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Every time I watch it, there's a new guy. I see it too. It's great. <laughs> well, it's pretty wild. Out. Seriously, yeah. <laughs> here's Exodus with Toxic Waltz. A fabulous disaster. Your album. It's um, many different types of disasters. Yeah, as far as I can tell. Well, why don't you explain the different disasters uh, we can find on the album? Oh, geez, um, there's too many of them. Starting <laughs> from. Uh, <laughs> Well, I don't know, it's just a blend of, it's, it's straight up metal, real heavy, but it's like, there's a whole, it's, I call it thrash with class, mm -hmm. that's what I like to call it. It's just like, it's real diverse, you know, it's, it's got some bluesy stuff and some all-out thrash stuff and it's great stuff. Lyric-wise, we have, uh, you know, if we go back to the disasters theme, social disaster, um, it's in the last act of defiance. Right, exactly. Yeah, um, yeah. Individual disasters, as in personal kind of disasters, uh, running th throughout the album, obviously. Don't give me that. This is one big disaster. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Actually, it's a great album, I love it. It's, yeah, there's uh, numerous different types of disasters available throughout the record, but <laughs> <laughs> it's not all quite so depressing. There's like some tongue-in-cheek tongue themes in there too, like the cover of Lowrider, Cajun Hell, and the video Toxic Waltz stuff. Mm -hmm. Hence, fabulous disasters. That's basically just about us. In the world's greatest fireworks show. <laughs> Why don't you guys hang out on the bus that you like so much for a little bit longer? This is our bus. Oh, man. In fact, you're I taking it out on the tour. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Right, here, right. Okay. My DX? If, if we can get it started. Some good <laughs> seems right for you right now. Isaac was talking about um, thrash with class. Is, is that what you said? Yeah, yeah. That's what we like to call it. Because you guys were around when it, thrash was just starting out, right? Yeah. How do you, do you, do you see any major t changes between thrash in the early days and now? Not really, it's, it's grown up like we all have, you know, like as, well, at our band, you know, individually we grow as musicians. There's not much change in the band, but, you know, mm -hmm. we still have the same attitude. It's gotten more refined and the lyrical content isn't quite as juvenile as it was in the Yeah, days. the first album, that's for sure. Now, you, you, this is about yourself, how about the, the overall thrash scene? Pretty much the overall scene, you know, I'm sure Metallica would be the first to admit that, you know, their first album lyrics weren't quite, you know, huge on the political side of things. Mm -hmm. What do you think of, uh, of, of One, for instance? Oh, I love it's it. It's brilliant. It's great. Yeah. Um, the tour, one more time. Remember now, in Long Beach, California. Begin. <laughs> <laughs> the start of the show. The highlight I, I, of the show. That's going, that going to be it. No, seriously, I'm looking forward to see you guys out there. It's going to be uh, wild. I it's going to be great fun. For, for dropping Come one, by. come all. Hang out, because we have, um, we have some more guests on the show coming up. Uh, Celtic Frost. Right. Who is that? Celtic friend, Frost. Tom. Well, Celtic, Celtic, people in Europe call it Celtic. I can't figure it out. Yeah. Okay. So you guys will hang out and, and watch that. Yeah. Thing? Yeah. Okay. So sure. in the meantime, we got uh, some I'll more for you on the ball. Oh gosh. Here's Croft with Jane. <laughs> 